Vaikuji ka Khalsa, Vaikuji ki Fateh, Gianna Sangaji, and welcome to Sikh Channel. So today's show is not the normal breakfast show, it's an exclusive interview that we have with Haradeep Singh, known as H. Singh Khalsa. The CV probably um, have been to a lot of programs that H. Singh Khalsa has done. As you know, he's basically international now, going to many, many different programs, and many of the Sangat obviously have been to the programs and have loved, obviously, the prachar that he does. So he's here with us today in the studio, and we're going to find out a little bit more, not just about his life, but a bit more about the Sikhi aspect, and also to see how he can encourage and inspire us and the panth going forward. Vaikuji ka khalsa, vaikuji ki fateh. Vaikuji khalsa, vaikuji fateh. Ji Aino, and welcome. Pleasure to be back again. I know, I was going to say. <laughs> and on that note, being back again, you were actually in casual clothes today. So tell us a little bit about why. I'm off to a party. No, I'm not really. What party? <laughs> <laughs> You're not <laughs> invited. OK. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. What is upcoming casual clothes today, just to um, show I'm a normal person. Mm -hmm. I don't need to be dressed in bana or pretend to be some kind of baba, which I'm not. Hanji. I don't know anything more than anybody else out there. I like to be relatable. Yeah. I like saying my divans as well. I'm the same. Yeah. There's nothing different. The only thing is, I'm just trying to relate to people out there. So just, just, just show that I am a normal person. I do yeah. just normal. I don't have to go out there to be in a barna to get yeah. my point across to people. I'm like to be relatable. Yeah. So, Baji, tell us, obviously, we all know who you are, you know, and I'm sure there's not anybody watching who doesn't know, but just tell us a little bit more, you know, about, about yourself as well. You know, just a brief intro. Um, basically, I came into Sikhi five and a half years ago, which I talked about in the last interview as well. Um, I sort of came into reading Gurbani melodically. Hanji. It was by accident. I was told to do a part one day to help with the glance of the Gurdwara. And under Awaji, I started to sing Gurbani. I don't know how it happened or what happened, but I didn't have confidence in my voice. I didn't have mm. confidence in myself whatsoever. I was just putting this on the spot. Hanji. I started reading Gurbani. But the feedback and the impact it had on the members of the Sangat straight away, I was told to keep carrying on doing what I'm doing. And then I got introduced to the Nanda Gardajis yeah. and I moved on to explain things in English as well. So it's moved on quite significantly, but it was just something within me which I had no yeah. clue about. Yeah. Which from the Sangat's feedback, yeah. I've started to more go more mainstream out there more. So tell me, Baji, you know, your, obviously your story was such an inspiration for me and for the Sangat and just now I can say this actually, you know, the feedback that I had from that interview that we had with you before was, you know, amazing. So many people were just have actually come on the path of Sikhi, but also just really enjoyed the interview and your story, Hana, because mm -hmm. it's true, it's a true story. Now, in your Divans, you talk a lot about, Hana, your, your journey into Sikhi. Yep. What has been, like, some of the reactions, if you could tell us, from the people, you know, up and down the country, what have they said? To be honest, when I talk during the Divans, the Divan itself is an experience. That's the how I try to do my Divans. I'm not like somebody out there telling stories no. or telling Saki on stage. Mm -hmm. We sing Shabads. Hanji. I try to explain the Shabads in English, explain to people in Punjabi as well Hanji. of what it means. Because when I do with the Divans, what it is, it has to relate to the elder generation Hanji. and to the young people as well. Mm -hmm. no yeah. It's not as though we go to programs and Bachino Sakalijo, but for Bajurga no Kon Samjave. But I, uh, what I know, I'll try and get out there for everybody to understand. Yeah. That's the whole point of the Divans. So when I talk about my life and how I came to Sikhi and the impact it's had on me mm -hmm. and how it's changed me, it's very rare there's a dry eye within the Darbar yeah. because people can relate to what I'm talking true. about because people are going through that Hanji. or thinking of going through that kind of phase. Yeah, it's true. And it's like, I've been through it. This is what happened to me. This is the impact. Yeah. I'm trying to help people to say, OK, if you can avoid it, avoid it. If you want to go down that route, completely up to you. You're your own person. It's your own life. Mm -hmm. But I've been through these things and yeah. this has happened to me. Yeah. And I'm trying to say, Sikhi's changed me for the better. Yeah. Sikhi was the only thing that saved me. It's true. Because I wouldn't be here today. I explained them all the interview as well. Andy, I wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for Guruji and Sikhi. So it's made a huge impact. And it's the feedback I've had from Sangat is inspirational yeah it's keeping us grounded yeah we're realizing yeah okay caught up on it caught up in these worldly things mm -hmm. we sometimes forget the sikhi aspect because true. there's a fine line between punjabi culture yeah and sikhi true what we try to do is like the two colors black and white Hanji. we've merged them together made a nice gray area in between we'll have a bit of that we'll have a mm -hmm. bit of that but sikhi is clearly defined there's parameters which you have to Definitely. fit inside 
find the cultural aspects. People come from Punjab, there's uh, this impact on you in, in the Zindagi, the music side of things, and all these things that happen, it's fine, it's great, it's cultural, it's not a problem. No. But when it comes to Sikhi, you've got parameters, and there's a clear line which you can't cross over in terms of staying there. But it doesn't mean Sikhi is strict. Mm -hmm. Okay, because we think we could go from a modern lifestyle exactly. into Sikhi. Hanji. Oh, it's a huge lifestyle. It's because we can't um, take on board the impact from going from one extreme to another mm. extreme, but it's not extreme. You try to cross over very gently, and then you get to the point thinking, yeah. hold on, why was I worried about Sikhi in the first no, place? True. It's a nice place to be, to be, and I'm a living example of that. And you know what, can I say something about you? I just recently went to Toronto, and just, I have to say this, and to the Sangat, you know the response I got from there for yourself? Mm -hmm. So we stayed with this really nice family and I was talking about you and I showed the interview. Mm -hmm. And you know Nindar, basically the girl who was in the family and the parents were sitting mm -hmm. there and the young boy and they were so inspired by your interview. They were amazed at, you know how you were before mm -hmm. to where you are now? And they're very much into like the belief of why guru and come on this path and obviously like you said it's a good place to be it's yeah. the only place to be your story for them was such an inspiration so mm -hmm. just so you know that in toronto the word spreading about the fajad that you're doing but they you know what they were so amazed by it yeah. really fascinating so ninda started following you now as well on facebook so it's just amazing to see that the word is spreading and your story has inspired many it's people it's the impact because like how you look from before and move it to what you look like now. Definitely. Just seeing that without no words, mm -hmm. it's a visual impact. True. A good example of that is my mum. Or I had problems, right, in my family yeah. before, but before, when I came to Sikhi. Hanji. I lost contact with all my family. I mm -hmm. deliberately moved away from all of my family. My mum eventually caught up with me, found out where I was. Yeah. Um, and she saw me after I'd gone. She didn't see the transition. She oh, saw from okay. one extreme where I was yeah. and the coming to the Sikhi side of things. Right. Just by the visual impact, yeah. after the third time mum actually met me, she turned up to her Amrita Sanjad herself and took really? Amrita. Really? And she took Amrita? Just the visual impact. That's amazing. See? This is what I mean. You, how you look is Bajad itself. Definitely. But like I say, the way I'm looking today, say, OK, I'm in Sikhi, mm. but I'm a regular person. We could be regular people. Yes. But within us, have Sikhi flourishing. Definitely. Because how you look doesn't determine what you are on the inside. No. We get very judgmental at people thinking, oh, an he yeah. looks like this kind of way, they've got no Sikhi within him. I know non Amritari people who've got okay. more Sharda, more Biafra Sikhi than some Amritari people true. do. So the look isn't always a contributing factor to say, oh yeah, that person looks like that, they must be in Sikhi. It's Anji. not. We've visually done that. Yeah. And the jokey thing, I'll, I could talk about that as well, yeah, is on. this is one guy, I'm not saying which Gorda it was. He bought a brand new white jawla. Okay. He bought a white, brand new jawla. He wore a white dastar. He brought a white magatra, okay. garpan. He went to the Gurdwara. Uh -huh. People thought he was a baba. Because of the uniform. Because of the look. And, the look. and he yeah, started Sanji. laughing. He goes, I'm only wearing a new jawla. I've really? had a new from India. This one I'm trying to say. People see a, a, a look and thinking, oh, baba. I know. I'm like, it doesn't determine what a person actually is. That's true. Bar under the rope. Under the rope. Under the rope. Under the rope. It's, that's what it comes down to. We look yeah. at somebody thinking, oh, had them on a joke and they're tikya, which are heni. We don't look at what the person's jindagi is about, mm -hmm. what they're about, what impact they're having. Have they got any back to what they're saying? We look at a roop and thinking, ha, a banda changaya, and o roop taalia, andro mara hove. Yes, true. This Makes guy was laughing. He goes, just what a new, we new chola, to some mantha technology, to some bapa. This is the thing. And, and just relating to that, that, that you, I don't know if you've seen the film Motor Mitrandi, which is actually about yeah. this, about, you know, wearing the, you exactly. know, the chola and the, out, and the outfit that they wear and that people are mantha taking and they're exactly. following. So they actually brought this to light to say that in reality, and you've just said it, it happens mm -hmm. that we, we judge by what exactly. somebody's wearing rather than exactly. andro de kohana exactly. You know, so, but then leading on from that, you've obviously got, um, Quite high demand for wedding services. Yeah. And obviously, you know, this is probably up and down the country and internationally. Yeah. Tell us, what are you doing different that other people are not? That obviously the Sangat are reaching out to you and saying, you know, we want you to do our wedding services. There's different elements. The first thing is, I think with weddings, it's, it's a big day. So we tend to go for emphasis on the party afterwards mm -hmm. where it's all nice decorated flowers the food's got to be great the music entertainment's got to be great it's a very lavish affair yeah, how people are doing true. these days but we tend to forget what the main part of the day is and yep. that's the actual ceremony mm -hmm. being at the gurdwara in front of Maharaj, saying Maharaj, we better move forward in our lives guide us yeah but what i'm trying to do with the nandagaj is okay yeah i read the lama very melodically yeah 
So mm-hmm. there's it's the singing element in it, and it's more emotional impact. Mm-hmm. The other aspect is I run the ceremonies in English and Punjabi. That's why as well. Normally you get the Granthi Sabs, so and I never take a dig at Granthis in this kind no. of way because they're the way they are. Mm-hmm. They have to do the ceremony in Punjabi because they can't explain in English. Yeah, true. So what I do, they I let the Girdhani explain what's going on. Yeah. I will then talk about it in English. Mm-hmm. I will guide the bride and groom through the whole process. That's brilliant. This is what you need to do. But I keep it very light-hearted as well. Hanji. Very unorthodox, but I crack a few jokes in between the ceremony as well. Okay. Notice, it's a nerve-wracking time. Yeah. The bride and groom are sitting there, they're nervous. I've had guys stop doing the Parakarama the wrong way. Oh, really? It's because it's just the impact, impact of the nun. The guys are under so much pressure. They don't know what's going on. They get up and they panic. That's true, because it's a lot It's very nerve-wracking. Mm-hmm. So I like mm-hmm. to get, relax them, talk Hanji. through. And one thing I do, I always meet the bride before oh, the ceremony's good. even started, before everyone's come to the Gurdwara. Why? Okay. The brides are very nervous. They are, yeah. It's good to meet them and say, hi, I'm doing your wedding ceremony for you today. Hanji. I'm running the service. Mm-hmm. You get to make that impact on, in that person, meet them face to face. And they're like, okay, I feel relaxed. So I joke about with them at the start so they know exactly what they're getting ready for. Yeah. So when they come to the bar, um, they know exactly what the ceremony is going to be about. They're more relaxed. Other thing I do as well is before the ceremony even starts, I'll try to explain to the Sangat yeah. where they are. Yeah. the protocols to observe while in the Gurdwara. Yeah. We're at a stage now where we, we think we're born in a Punjabi family, we go to Gurdwara, we know what to do. Exactly. But the the Baraj in Narola Hunda, in Nyangala Hundiaya, Funa Bajindaya, and it's all on film. Mm. So I tried to explain to Pesang at the start, this is what the Gordwara is. Exactly. This is where Good. you are, who Guruji is, in a very Hanji. polite manner. Yeah. And try to explain to look, you're all family members. Yeah, You're invited here at somebody's big day. Hanji. You're not here to ruin it. Mm-hmm. If you want to talk on your phones, there's plenty of room outside. Exactly. Keep your phones off. You're in the place of Guru Maharaj. Hanji. So explain things very politely to them. No, that's good. And touch wood, there hasn't been... Mahdi's Giri Padanal, there has been a single wedding where I've done where phones have gone off. Oh, that's fantastic. The bride fantastic. and groom are there and the whole Darbar is quiet. Mm-hmm. When they're doing the registrar wedding, Hanji. it's quiet. They can talk, talk to the registrar and everyone can hear it. It's quiet. Yeah. So these are the kind of things where this impact being made. And all the thing I do at the end as well, I tried to do beforehand, but if I do at the end, it's one of those things. But explain to what the vows are. That's good. What the Nanda God is, what each alarm represents, what, Hanji, it means. what it means. So you know exactly what you're doing there, you know exactly what you're getting involved in, because mm-hmm. the Nanda God is serious business. No, it is, exactly. Very, very serious yeah. business, which I'm trying to emphasise. And then when you're in that kind of situation, Hanji. It's not an ego thing I'm trying to no, say. No, it's people generally calling but saying, Wow, I've never been in a ceremony like this before. It's no. been clearly explained. Exactly. We know exactly what's do- what's happening here. And you keep it light-hearted. The interaction, the connection with the Sangha, exactly. that's the impact I'm trying to make. Hanji. We've lost that. We have. People don't know. No, they turn up as a ritual, do four paragarama yes. at the door, let's go and do a party. That's and they don't, they're losing the essence of what a non is. It, what it is. And you know what? That's so true. Because I think up until now, since you've started doing it, mm. A lot of weddings that I've attended is the, is the fact that people are not interested. Phones mm. are going off, people are talking, and you're in the darbar. Mm. And obviously the most highest of the highest is there. Exactly. Would we be talking if we were in the courtroom? We wouldn't, would we? No. If we were in court, we wouldn't, right? So our guru is the highest of the highest. So I think it's brilliant what you're doing because you're mm. spreading that word. And, and I can say from, from the youngster perspective that for me, I'm going to book you for mine. So make sure no matter how busy your diary is, you have to make that time for oh, me. But, but it's, you know what, it's fantastic because I think you must get a lot of feedback as well. And have, like, have you yeah. kept in touch with people that have got married to say, just uh, actually tell me about your feedback that you've had from people who have had you. I've had mixed reactions, them. I'll be honest with you. Um, most of it's positive. I'll say 95% of the um, uh, feedback I've had is very, very positive. Okay. Especially from the young generation yeah. and from the elder generation. There's a good prime example. Yeah. There's one really senior guy, Bajora Gaya Medical. Mm-hmm. He brought his niece with him. Um, sorry, he brought his um, grand niece with him. Okay. And they came, to, came behind the Baliki Saab mm-hmm. after doing the Nandakar, and the guy couldn't talk. He was crying. The ba- Bajora was crying. He goes, he goes, pointed at his grandniece to say, do the talk. She goes, Baba just wanted to say to me before, he's been so impacted Aww. by how he did ceremony in Punjabi and explained things. Yeah. She just can't talk. So That's it's amazing. like older it's generation, young generation, everyone's relating to because you yeah. do a certain way. Other people, you get a lot of negative people as well. They just don't care. Right. They're just there's a formality mm-hmm. and they're just here to go to the afternoon party and that's all they're interested in. They don't want to hear it. The reason why they don't want to hear yeah, it is tell me. because sometimes when you speak the truth, people don't, don't like, like it, it because they think, hold on, he's talking to me personally about what my life's about. 
But you don't understand what I'm trying to say, explain to people and explain no. to the bride and groom is what Guruji is saying. Yeah, exactly. And sometimes we don't like hearing the truth and these people are going to be negative. There's some places where I'm going to, and I don't want to say which places they are, some people just don't like what the Norja one's doing anything. That's true. They don't like the younger generation explaining anything, because I think, hold on, mm. It's not about being young or old, it's about Gyan or Vandana. Definitely. If you be going to the Gurdwara 30, 40 years, mm, and when somebody tells the truth, which is what I do, you and I to. to you at, at you the start as well. They don't go to Bingi Marde, they go to Siddhi Marde, Messidi Anja, Messidi Goli Marnia. Whether it impacts on you or not, it doesn't matter. Sometimes these things need to be done. It's needed. Banda Jag, Banda, I think, you know what? It's true what he's saying. But we don't want to hear it. And also, Padi, did that again, this game about Norjuan Jere Hegea. If we don't come forward, right? Mm -hmm. Because that's what it is, right? The youth have to come forward. Exactly. If, if the Siane don't encourage us, you know, and you must know yourself, like criticism is a big yeah. thing. Somebody could go 10 steps back. Yeah. So we have to encourage them. And, and the thing is, nobody's perfect. No. Who doesn't make mistakes? We need to learn. And you're doing that. Like by mm. doing what you're doing, you're kind of, you know, like you're, you're, not only are you taking steps towards your guru, but you're taking steps towards all the sangat to come towards exactly. them. Do you see what I mean? This was saying Devan, I said, look, I'm still learning to crawl. Yeah. The one thing saying every Devan, I'm still learning to crawl. Crawl with, with me. you, yeah. I remember you said that. Crawl with me. Let's do this together. Yeah. But let's help each other. This is what Sikh is about. It doesn't matter if you're in Sikh, it's Dharam. It doesn't matter if you're Christian, Hindu, whatever you are. That's it, exactly. Let's, we're all trying to get to the ultimate goal that mm. is Paramatma. Hanji. Okay. Yeah. So if we can help each other on that path, why can't we? Exactly. It comes to a point where the, the elder generation, the younger generation, they're at loggerheads. We are trying to do things to work hand in hand, let's move together. Exactly. Yeah. Because the younger generation, what these, we've got to a point now where younger generation are saying why to everything. They are. Why does this happen? Hanji. Why do we do this? Yeah. And when the older generation can't explain these kind of things, it's like, well, you ask me things, I shouldn't have to explain these kind of things, we don't want to change the system. They're finally, it's a threat. Exactly. It's not a threat. People are more curious, they're asking more questions. They why? Are. They've got a PR for Sikhi. Not to say the old generation haven't. No. The older generation made so, many, so much impact coming, coming to these countries mm. and starting this Gordwari. Guinea Sikhi flourishing. They made those they did, sacrifices Hanji. for the lives. We're indebted to them forever. Very true. But to move it forward, as times are moving, we have to work hand in hand. Hand in hand. But it seems as though it's us against them. It's not. No. Let's work in hand. Say, okay, searching through your body, But it's always seen as a threat. with no one against the older generation. It shouldn't be like that. No, We've sure. got respect for the Bajorik. That's We've it. got respect for the older generation. Hanji. They're our Martha Pita. They are. They understand it. We've always got the respect for them. Hanji. But let's change with time. And sometimes changing things see, it's ultimately seen as a threat. No. No, it it's is. not. No. It's a positive impact how we can move forward and flourish Sikhi. Mm. Now, from Guru Gobind Singh's time, how much has Sikhi moved forward? That's true. It has. Yeah. It's not. It's not moved forward. It's remained stagnant. Oh, because you feel it hasn't. Do I don't you, think it's moved it, forward that much. How much has Sikhi flourished? It's sort of gone back. But now the younger generation is trying to move it forward. Yeah, the that wall's being built. Yeah, exactly. And they don't want people to move forward. They don't no. want that impact on themselves. It's remaining stagnant. Now these things are happening now, where the walls are being broken down. Yeah, that's it. Exactly. And the crossover. Yeah. Is hitting a certain generation. People don't want to have this kind of experience or yeah. they don't like what's happening. No. Why? They're not accustomed to it. It's not their fault. No, exactly. But let's work hand in hand. Let's, yeah. let's work together. And that working hand in hand is sort of the thing that's threatening a lot of people and people don't like it. Why? And Gordwari are a place of ego. Yeah, that's the problem. And, and they're yeah, battlegrounds. Really Why? It's about seen as authority, mm -hmm. this and that. It's help. It's like maybe bali bali hove. I've got this seat. It's like a power struggle that's going no, on there. Fair enough. Gordwar is a tadamsal. Hanji. Ote apnu loknu sikhna jorna. Sikhna exactly. And that's Hanji. what it's not anymore. No. It's power struggle. Hone dekha kine gordar danga karak diya. Mm -hmm. I've been to gordar the danga karak diya. Why? What's the essence of it all? It's about power, ego. Which we should know. And it's not about yeah. that. It shouldn't be about that. And no. this is what the saddening thing is. And when the Norge one trying to teach this kind of thing, it's not. Not we don't want this happening. Why? Our seats could be threatened inside the Gordwani. It's not mm -hmm. about your seats. We're trying to bring people to the city, have a PR for you, make your family environment. These people don't want anything happening like that. That's true. And the, where I was saying I feel that it's moving forward is because I feel the youth are trying. Do you see what I mean? Yeah, As yeah, in move, if they didn't try, yeah. then I'd say no, we're at a standstill. Mm -hmm. And then again, going back to my trip in Toronto, mm -hmm. 
you know, there I saw the six were ahead of us. Yeah. Far, like so ahead of us here in the like in the UK. Mm. But again, it's probably just from seeing a lot of the youngsters that they are trying and yeah. they're not taking any criticism as no. Magarna ni, yeah, Magarna, yeah. you know, which is what a sick would do. Yeah, yeah. I know you and just like you are, you're mm. not giving up and I'm sure you do get a lot of criticism from people, mm. but you do, you just say it as it is, which is fantastic. Is. Straight talking is the best way. Why is such a it's true. Okay. And truthful living. When you start lying to people, saying, That's it. You're, you're having a battle between yourselves because you, you can't talk the truth. How are you going to make the impact on anyone else? That's true. How to you? talk the truth, people, to hear the truth, you're going to be talking the truth. That's it, exactly. Some people are out there, I'm not going to name people. I know no. people go out there and do, and they do bajar on stages. The people go out there and talk to people within Sangat. But a lot of these people, some of these people have got hidden agendas. Yeah. They do in a certain way, I think, Sadi Bali Bali Hove. I'm not saying the ones, just them at the ones that are bad, they stay at the upper bed. I know, me, Apani Bali Bali Kitia, Dutia Marke, when a telebataldio. I'm not there for my Bali Bali. Exactly. I'm talking to Sangat about my experiences, trying to explain them, make an impact. I want everyone to do the same thing. If someone sits on stage and wants to do what I'm doing, which I'm not doing anything special, come and sit on stage, teach me something. I just, I've been on, st- I'm on stages because people have told me, I just sit on the stage and tell us these things. Of course, they We're like listening to you, mm. you explain things logically, it's straightforward and straight talking, and that's what I do. 95% of the Sangat that comes to the Divans are non Amratari. And I say, of the 95%, I would say 90% of them mm. are people who don't know nothing about Sikhi. Yeah. There's no point doing Parjaw to people who have a bit of an idea. What would the people who haven't got a clue? They don't know where to start. They don't know where to start. This is why I sort of have been marginally by the now. I'm doing something where it's made an impact onto people who don't know much about Sikhi and they think, you know what, this is refreshing. Because, Baji, that was my question. Next question that, you know, you've done quite a few Divans up yeah. and down the country. Do you feel that the message that you're telling the Sangat has made an impact? And if it has, g- give us an example of how. Okay, yeah, the, the ones are making an impact. Why? A, because the Kirtan's been done in a certain way. Hanji, I've seen. The yeah. part's been read in a certain kind of Hanji. way, melodically. We think about wow, it's emotional. The Devans are done very emotionally. Hanji. Not because we're there to say, oh, sorry, Sangat, run di hove. It becomes emotional. Why? Because people get caught in the music. And they're caught in the way the Giritan's done with the Biyad, and the barn is read with the Biyad. Mm. And people start feeling the Biyad, they think, you know what, I don't understand what Maharaj is saying, Hanji. but there's an emotional impact here. I feel a presence. So I've been to some divans where Amardari guys have come over to me and said, Baji, I've come into Sikhi and I've got lost a bit. Okay. And I don't know what to do, but somehow, listening to what you had to say, Hanji. it's brought me back. Oh. It's nice to hear, that's nice. but it's not me that's doing it, no, it's it, Maharaj. Hanji. I've been to the vans and I, I laugh with the guys that are with me as well and some of the families that I sit with, I said, I have to look at the recordings back. Hanji. I don't know half the stuff that I stay on stage, why? Okay. I do a dance for on stage, I say, Maharaj, you have a great day, you have a great stage. So it's not me. I don't know half the stuff I come out with, no. and people laugh at me thinking, "Paji, you said this thing on stage." I don't know. I've said it. Yeah. I look back at me, because I have. It's hard to explain. I, I have out of body experiences when I'm on stage. Okay. And when I'm sitting in front of Marjan and Tabia, Hanji. There's times where I'm not there. Really. I'm not there. Gosh. And then I think back, oh my God, such a dog into Hogan's Oh my God, my road around South of the Party is taking what, an hour? Hanji. I don't realise why. I don't know why it happens to me about, about experiences. I'm not there. Yeah. Hence why I look at footage afterwards. Wow. And it's what just... I've said in that times, it's made an impact on people. Yeah. yeah, positive and negative on people. Because some people don't want to hear, they go from the divine and they go. Yeah. But it's such a. Exactly. I'm going to say what Guruji is saying, and I'm going to say in a way where sometimes the shock tactic works. Yeah. It's like, oh my God. Did the Hannah Enemas or Stairs or Chipper, Mari Hundia, but Chipper Piardia? Why? That's true. You think, you know what? It's made an impact on me. I've learned something. You know what? I have been doing certain things wrong. I do a lot of things wrong. No, I'm not saying Menus of Gushpata, Menu Giana, Menu Kuchinipata. I've got Nimrata in that kind of way because yeah. I have got no Gian. Gian Delva Maharaj. Hanji. But if I can learn something myself, um. I'm just doing the same thing, sharing it with the Sangat. That's all I'm trying to do. And that's what you're trying to do. And you know, I can say, Zabaji, from being to your Divans, you need to do more in West London because you <laughs> are doing a fantastic job. And just, you know, even from my parents, you know, when they've seen your, the programmes and, you know, just even today, mum was like, I need to come into the studio to just see Baji. So mm. it's brilliant, you know, that you're doing. I do more Divans in London, you know what it is? The, this is one of the issues we're facing. Okay. A lot of Gordwara 
are very reluctant to get outsiders yeah. to come and do programmes. Fine, sometimes it's as though the grantees feel threatened or things like the grantee be Jungia. It's not about Jungai. Yeah. It's not about somebody being better. Yeah. It's all about saying, um, look, I'm doing something different. Mm -hmm. Let's come do the programs. But I think sometimes they're scared about someone's on a mic. Yeah. But the microphone, the very key, Sadu Ortna, Sadu Varna, got together. These kind of barriers we're trying to break down. So. Baji, sorry, we're going to go for a short no break. Worries. Where we're going to continue after the break. Okay. So, Sangaji, Marf Gadiho, that the time's gone by so quick, but the CJR Pilio, and we'll be back after the break. Vaikachi ka Khalsa, Vaikachi ki Fateh. Vaikachi ka Khalsa, Vaikachi ki Fateh. Sangaji, welcome back after the break. I hope the CJR Pilio and even Bronte Kali or even a biscuit. Um, when we're going to join back with Hardeep Singh just in regards to finding out a bit more about their life, their journey, and obviously a bit more about the Sikhi Prajad as well. So if you didn't join us in the first half, you'll find out a bit more in the second half. And as I always say, even in the previous interview that we had with Baji, we never have enough time. So we'll have to obviously bring Baji back. But let's continue with the questions and find out a bit more about Baji's journey and what, what more we can learn as well. So Baji, why could you cards why could you give a bit? The time goes by so quick and I've got... You a, talk I've, too much, that's I've what got, it is. And I've got a list of questions. <laughs> so, OK, tell me, do you feel that Jere Sadino, Juan Hege, that all jor there more with your parjad more than the older generation? Um, I wouldn't say it's just me. I think anyone who can go on a stage okay. and talk about, do parjad, explain things about Gurbani, is doing something that's going to join anybody. Anyone, but the nor do want to relate anymore. Why? Because it's broken down. Mm -hmm. We're talking in English. Yeah. Gurmukhi is our language. Hanji. It's our alphabet. Punjabi is the kind of thing we talk about, yeah, fine. We should learn it. Yeah. We should bring it into our lives and speak it. Yeah. Okay? But these things don't happen overnight. What we're trying to do is build up the yard with people to say, this is what Sikh is about, this is yeah. how beautiful it is. And the Nord one are liking it, the younger generations are liking it. Why? It's refreshing. Yeah. It's in English, they can relate to it. Mm -hmm. When you start talking that kind of way, people think, you know what? Yeah, I can, I, I can talk to that, but I like mm. I listen to what they're talking about because yeah. I understand it straight away. Yeah. Once they've got a PR for it, then they'll start understanding Punjabi a bit more. Yeah. And then they'll be just like saying, yeah, I want to attend the Gurdwara more. Mm. At the moment, Nordvan, young generation, don't want to come to the Gurdwara. Why? That's what, yeah. Battlegrounds. Exactly. They're not learning anything. It's okay. about Matha Dek. Granthis go off on one, and then we don't know what's going on. Prashad Shaku, Gallankaro, Karnu Jao. And people think, I'd rather go to the gym. I'd rather go out somewhere. Hanji. Do you see why, like I said before, the Nandakarajis, normally I've done it before, mm -hmm. it's like, we're there, Matateko, can't relate to this. Some of the lads go to the pub. They're losing the interest in they do. That's where they, they don't want to be there. Exactly. Think, oh, let us know when you better leave them and go to the party. Hanji. It's, how can we retain these people within the Gurdwari? How can they have Biafo Maharaj? If we're not linking that um, Biar, that person to Maharaj, the link's broken. Hanji. How are people going to sit there? You get bored. That's it, exactly. You don't understand what's going on. You, when you're talking English, Hanji. doing the bad job, you're thinking, you know what, I've learnt something today and that's what it's about. And you have to be engaged and you're saying engaged. that a lot of the youth like to have it in English simply mm -hmm. because, Baji, look, even with our time growing up, the Punjabi has been then. Yes, it's very important, and the Punjabi is mm. important. But you've had a lot of the Punjab done in Punjabi, but mostly for the for the parents, Hannah. Mm -hmm. For our youth, a lot of them do engage mm. and join more to the Punjab because it's in English, because they understand, Hannah. Mm. And I think once they understand it more in English, that's when you're right. Like, as in, they'll probably if they don't know Punjabi, they'll learn more about exactly. Gurmukhi, Hannah. But you've got yeah. to you've got to in the first instance get them to walk the path. You've got to bridge that gap. Exactly. That's what it's about. Hanji. If you can bridge that gap, if somebody wants to come to the Gurdwara and Hanji. learn more, mm -hmm. you're halfway there. That's true. Why? Because they want to come to the Gurdwara. But like I say, you can still make an impact at home as well. You can, yeah. It's true. all on the internet. True. You've got people like Base of Sikhi, Sikh to Inspire, all these major organisations. You've got Mindas and Langa Seva, SWAT teams going out there. They're approaching Sikh in different kind of ways. They are, yeah. Do you understand? So this Sikh is so broad, there's so many aspects to it. It's all about being engaged, find out what's right for you, learn a bit more. The sangha that you keep, very important. Yeah, you is. go out with these um, uh, people, go out to do this langar on the streets. I've been with SWAT on one of the yeah. occasions. Um, and how Bob Binder Singh's doing with the Mindas Langa Seva, yes. he's won awards and stuff. Great thing Hanji. that they're doing. Exactly. We need sangha, in that kind of sangha, you're there doing something, you spread the name of Guru Nanak, they're yeah. their mission. you got sangha like that around you, it impacts on you. you got this PR, and you think, you know what? This is what I feel comfortable, and you start learning that PR starts growing, Hanji. and that's what we're missing these days. We haven't got that PR. I do it, I say in the vans, even though Marjda Parkashete, Don Haru Guru Labani, 
Anna say twice a day, Halton Samjai, Marge de Parcachet, and Guru Marge is here, but Harlet on Guruji Labani Wai Andropiarni. That's what it is. And Baji, that leads on to my next question, very important question. What is our purpose in life? Because from, from me, what I know is that our purpose is to meet my Guru, like mm. you're saying, Labani. Some people think, some people don't know. They don't know. You know, life could go by and they have no idea. What is our purpose in life? And just to send that message to the Sangha so that. You know, someone watching could think, okay, you know what, actually, you know, but that's what I want to do. Why are we here? Why are we given the human life? From the Gurbani side of things, Maharaj talks about it very, very easily. We're only on here, this planet, in this room, because we've gone around the Jarasi Jun. That's it, Andrew. Okay? We've got the most amazing, amazing Jun we could have, which is, which is this body. Andrew. Maharaj explains to us, Pai Parapata. Manuk de Huria, Gob in the Milky, a heteri paria. Se pei parapata, Manuk de Huria, de Munukasaria, this body that we've. He goes, pei parapata, you've obtained this, it's been gifted to you. Okay? But why have you been given this body? And explain this in advance, everything I want to go to. I'll try to explain this over and over again. Gob in the Milky, a heteri paria, Gob in the Zarab, a carpet of who I grew. It was Gob in the Milky, a heteri paria. This is your only chance. Hanji. It's your own purpose to have this body to meet Rab. Yeah. Margaret moves on to say, Avarakaj tere kitte na kaam. Nothing, Nothing else is going to work. Don't tere soch nahi. Why are you trying to think, you know, menu jada pata hai. Exactly. No man mo khu de. Menu sab kuch pata hai. No. Margaret goes, kuch nahi chal na. Hanji. So I've got this body. I need to merge with God. If what I'm thinking, what I'm trying to do on a daily basis is not going to help me, what do I, how do I merge? Mil saad sangat hai. Sit within the Saad Sangat. It's all about Sangat around you. But Sangat which Karna Kiya? The Saad Paj Keval Naam. Paj Na Bandhi Kar O Keri Naam. Naam Di Hanji. What's Guruji telling you in each Shabad? Naam Jap, Naam Jap, Naam Jap. There's another Pangat which talk about Maharaj goes, Amrat Naam Parameser Tera. Hanji. Jo Simere So Jeeve. Jeeve. Hanji. So did a Naam Simrat Amrat Naam. Very simple Guru Mukhi. No, it is exactly. Jo simre so jive. Jo simrda ya, o jinda ya. Jir nai simrda hon tese aap dekhlo. Jinda ya chanta kide ya chanta. That's true. And Guruji is hitting it straight. Hanji. But we don't want to hear this kind of things. No, we don't. So our maksad here is not just to meet Vahe Guru, merge back to our Creator. Just like a droplet of water. Hanji. Goes from the ocean as a as a cloud. Comes down as a raindrop, Hanji. and it tries to merge back to its source, which is the sea, the ocean again, which is what we are with us droplets of rain. Hanji. Now, if we don't head towards the ocean and we just remain stagnant to where we are, Hanji. what does that become? A shabbar. Okay. And we know what a shabbar is mm. a swamp kind Hanji of thing, is what what dirty yeah. water. Mm. Oh, make it a gandaya. Up a gandaya chuna, do you want to merge back to our Wahi group? Yeah. Because the dunya is trying to hold us back from that droplet from merging yeah, back. Exactly. We say no. And Paan has got so much nimrta, Hanji. it's the most humble thing. Why? He always tried to find the most lowest point ever. Hanji. Nima ya renda ya. That's it. In that path of humbleness, you can merge back with Vaheguru. And these are the simple things where people are not even explaining it. No, they're not. We and make it very complicated. That's the thing. It's a simple uh, message. You've got this boy for one thing. Merge back with Vaheguru. Merge back. And then, Paji, like you said, when it gets complicated, people tend to walk away. Yeah. They're not interested. So if somebody, for example, watching, and I can't do Baad, mm -hmm. and they can do their Simran, is yeah. that still just as much, you know, effective or, or it's better than doing nothing, right? Simran yep. is, is quite... Small steps are better than taking no steps at all. Okay, Hanji. Okay. If somebody finds Gyan and, and, and bliss Hanji. by doing Simran, Simran Karijo. Okay. Once you start experiencing Wahigri through Simran, Hanji. you start wanting to under Piyar Peda Hoki, you want to learn more. Okay. You think, you know what, I want to learn some Gurbani. Hanji. No one's telling you to become a Garanti overnight. No one's telling you to read Guru Garan Sahib overnight. Okay, expand forward, move forward, start doing Moola Mantar. Hanji. Then we want to do Japji Sada part. Okay. No one's telling you to Rato Rath, Reyes Lagia, Hanji. Agge Boncho. There's no race. No, it's true. We're trying to think, oh my God, I need, I'm in Sikki now, I need to do this, I need to, oh, I'm going to go, Reyes Gia. We don't know what our finishing lines are. That's true, exactly. And we also don't know when our last breath is. Exactly. Right, you could be a breath away. So time is a factor. Hanji. Kay buddy, I'll laugh in the vans as well. Make a gay source to Hunde because make Bahane not to come into the path of Sikhi. Kay Bahane Labadea, Jado Sade Kiripa Hovegi, Jado Bajorg Hoge, Fedum Jorp Mange, Maga Jotanu up in a Karmanda Pata, Manut on Numatakanajaida. Because you can see your karma. You can see. 
ਜਿਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਅੰਤਰ ਜਮੀ ਬਣ ਗਏ ਯੂ نو एवरीथिंग ਤੁਸੀਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਬ੍ਰਾਹਮਣ ਜੀ ਬਣ ਗਏ ਕਿ ਸੀ ਆਲ ਥਿਸ ਕਾਈਂਡ ਆਫ ਥਿੰਗਸ ਇਟਸ ਬਿਹਾਨੇ ਵਾਈ ਵੀ ਜਸਟ ਥਿੰਕ ਆਓ ਵੀ ਮੇ ਗੈ ਆਲ ਦਸ ਥਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਡੂ ਅਨਾ ਲਾਫ ਇਨ ਦ ਬਾਜ਼ ਮੇ ਕੋ ਹੋਨੀ ਤਾਂ ਕੋ ਚੋਂਕਰਾ ਮਾਰ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਪਾਠ ਪੜਨ ਤੇ ਬਜ਼ੁਰਗ ਹੋ ਕੇ ਕੀ ਕਰਨਾ ਹੈ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਲਾਕੇ ਸੇ ਇਟਸ ਟਾਈਮਸ ਆ ਫੈਕਟਰ ਆਈ ਕੁਡ ਲਾਟ ਯੂ ਇਨ ਦਿਸ ਇੰਟਰਵਿਊ ਨਾ ਮੇਰੇ ਸਾਸ ਇਥੇ ਮੁਕ ਸਕਦੇ ਆ ਟਾਈਮ ਇਜ਼ ਆ ਫੈਕਟਰ ਕਸ ਮਾਰ ਇਜ਼ ਰਿਮਾਈਂਡ ਮੋਰ ਮੋਰ ਕੇ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਹੇਅਰ ਫॉर ਵਨ ਪਰਪਸ ਇੱਕ ਕੰਮ ਲੈ ਆਏ ਇੱਥੇ ਗੱਡੀਆਂ ਕਾਰ ਪੈਸਾ ਇਕੱਠਾ ਜਮਾ ਕਰਨੇ ਇਹ ਚੰਨਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਨਾਲ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਵਸੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਕਰਮੀ ਗਨੇ ਕੇ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਪਰ ਈਵਨ ਸਟਿਲ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਹੇਅਰ ਫॉर ਵਨ ਪਰਪਸ ਉਹਨੂੰ ਪਲਾਨ ਆ ਰਬ ਨੂੰ ਪਲਾਨ ਆ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਹੇਅਰ ਫॉर ਵਨ ਮਿਸ਼ਨ ਮਰਜ ਬੈਕ ਵਿਦ ਵਾਈ ਹੈਡ ਐਂਡ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਵਾਟ ਵੀ ਨੀਡ ਟੂ ਫੋਕਸ ਔਨ ਮਾਈ ਬ੍ਰੇਕਿੰਗ ਅਵੇ ਫਰਮ ਇਟ ਨਾ ਇਟਸ ਟ੍ਰੂ ਐਂਡ ਦ ਬਾਡੀ ਟੈਲ ਮੀ ਔਨ ਅ ਡੇਲੀ ਬੇਸਿਸ ਵਾਟ ਕੀਪਸ ਯੂ ਮੋਟੀਵੇਟਿਡ on a daily basis well my guru ji keeps me motivated sikhi keeps me motivated but it's also people who come into my life as well okay. um there's a few there's i mean like I say i've got role models within my life and that's like the shaheeds that at least learn about the sakhiya char sahib da de panch pyare our guru ji massive role models yeah. even though our guru they are role models why they, they practice what they taught they did hanji okay all our shaheeds by mani singh baba deep singh ji all these shaheeds even now the shaheeds at jarasi they are hanji all these people who were still shaheed they hon tak bhi paidan yeah. their their lives that's are true. amazing these are our role models also people who are in modern day i mean there's there's one person i'm not going to mention their name there's one person who is in my life at, the, at this moment in time and they've made such a huge impact oh that's good to me they're a role model why they've impacted on me in my own personal life as that's well that's very good so i mean this person got drive really? ambition yeah they're focused they are very grounded and that drive that they've got i mean you can easily go through life in auto cruise in Andrew, cruise control yeah you could you're just going through and that's the thing i fell into hanji because i mean sick it doesn't necessarily mean oh well, this guy's got it all made hanji i went into cruise control okay and what this person has come into my life hanji and that has such amazing impact That's on good. me that is driven me to like my own personal life to do certain things and like snap out what you're doing yes. there's more you can achieve and this person is so amazing and oh, i'll say it on air so amazing that even though they're not sick of themselves they they're not go, amrit tari but they all right and i make this clear they're not amrit tari mm-hmm. but they got so much i would say the essence of rab within them hanji it's so beautiful i can imagine we all got our flaws i've That's got them they've yeah, got them exactly. as well so it's not a problem true. but the driving ambition has snapped me out of this kind of cycle mm-hmm. that i was in it's like i can do things myself yeah. and that's what i'm trying to do now so buddy you're not in cruise control now you're in yeah. fifth gear and you had a positive impact on yeah. this person which is fantastic to hear and i yeah. is that really good to see that's what we all need yeah, yeah. Um so tell me about your album because obviously we discussed this last time yeah. it hasn't been released yet no. do you have a release date and do we sick channel get a free copy <laughs> It's all going to be free it's all going to be free oh, we're not making a penny out of it oh, that's really so good. it's all going to be free oh, downloadable so okay oh, it's going to be all major places we can buy from buy CDs oh, of it and they'll send it through that I'm saying because we're doing it yeah, because they're doing that's really good It's been held off for a while because I got ill start this year okay. so it held off Yeah it's been mastered at the moment we've got mm-hmm. other people working on it so there's a lot of things that need but like I say they're not just focusing that I'm saying not just focusing on my project okay there's a lot of things happening in the background these Hanji. guys are very busy people they've got their own yeah, personal lives and they're taking time out to do these kind of things Hanji. so we rather get this album perfect okay perfect as much as it can be we're not say we know we're not everything perfect as it can be but there is going to be a release date coming out soon we just at the final stages of it now we okay. rather come out at night at a decent time Hanji. we put it for it's going to be january release first then we thought vasaki time but it's been delayed a bit now but we rather have it out there it's coming out okay um the guys that I'm have confirmed online as well that okay. it's going to be coming out very very soon so we're just at the final stages so it's for here for everybody okay that's once brilliant. that get released I'll really go good. to all the channels and start recording gurbani live for them as well oh, not okay, that I'm well. somebody special no but that's if good I can do it live and Hanji. people can download it as well listen to it have a visual Hanji. impact great we'll do as much as we can but I can't do that at the moment why because I'm just restricted because I rather get this out there clear yes. copies people to listen to and then they can and will you update this on your social media page yeah, for when it will be announced released? facebook okay. instagram okay. dot server records website um on their facebook and top place as well it's going to be a global oh, release wow. okay canada australia is going to be oh, everywhere yeah. Yeah. so we can try and do this in the charts as well okay so the downloadable charts is yeah. going to be there the more people download it the better yeah. it is because we're trying to do something different that's good and people from india are going crazy over at the moment yeah. just doing when in the record studio the dot server did it live on their facebook yeah and the amount of likes and people saying who's this guy 
we haven't heard Gurbani in this kind of way. That's what we have to do. It's not about me. Yeah. Gurbani, here's a new way of doing Gurbani. Yeah. Here's a different way of doing it. It's a bit yeah. unorthodox. Oh, I've had people saying to me, Bani, I don't want to do I should do it in a certain way. But why not? This is the thing. Why not? Exactly, Hanji. And have you got any albums coming out in the future? Obviously, after this one, anything that you're working on? This is phase one. Okay. So with this album, we've got Herrera Sauda Part, which Hanji. is one of the things which a lot of people are relating to at the moment, it's the evening part. Hanji. We've got Araki and the Shabbat, the Girit and the Soil, and Joel Besab as well. Okay. But it's not Joel Besab in the way that he was read at Jagaraj Singh's party, okay. um, 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 uh, Bart. Hanji. Uh, is, um, uh, is, the, when he did the, the When he did the programme last, Hanji, last program. year. Um, it's, it's that different. was done in a way where the song that can join in. Mm -hmm. And it's made a huge impact, so that's available online now anyway. Okay. The way I've done Rera Sal Bart in this way is because it's just the way I do it. Yes, okay. It's understand. just the way it comes out. I mean, it's been caught naturally in okay. a recording studio, so it's hopefully a different way where people may think, oh, well, that's a different way of doing it. I can relate to that as well. Yeah. So trying to impact as many people as we can. Mm -hmm. Second phase is going to be probably Jabta Sada Bart or the Nitin and Bani, I'm even Sukhna Sada Bart. And there's another project which I'm not going to talk about this moment in time. Okay, you can share it with us. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can't let the cat out of the bag. The cameras, no. Um, but it's, it's not something we're going to try and do later on, but that's going to be a long term kind of project. But okay. we'll get there eventually, Marjorie Kiripa. Okay. Then. And then, so watch this space actually, Sankaji, for the album details online on the social media page. And obviously, we will keep you in informed as well. So you've been to in, you've been to India recently yep. to conduct a wedding service. Yep. Have you got any more international plans in the future? I think I've got a few more weddings coming up in India, okay. which is a big thing when yeah. people are inviting you to go to exactly. a place where the Sikhi is flourishing and there's people there to do this kind of thing. Oh, we want someone from the UK to come and do it. It's a big thing. But then Not for me. To go and do. It's a big thing. This is the thing. And a question for me is, is Sikhi flourishing there then, Hannah? If they are, as you see what I mean. So question for me and a lot of the Sankhati is, well, is it? Because you're going there. So it shows a bit of a... I did a funny thing. I, luckily, when I went to do this wedding in India earlier this year, with the band that I was staying at, it wasn't the band that I'm at. Okay. It, I, was, I was right to say at somebody's place there. Yeah. In the morning, I just went to Jake. Go on the microphone, speaker lack a part, but good thing was, and this is the honest truth, yeah. ek banda hana, but then my, the Raj from the microphone was going so far because I did do it four o'clock. Yeah. I started half past three in the morning. Okay. So I had a head start on some of the other Gordwari. Right. Not as a race, not no, as like not that, as a thought, hunty. And this guy, oh, duro, duro, patnik, he goes, me patnik, kinne kilometer to dura aya. Oh. Labda aya Raj kitho on diya. Wow. He asked, asked, and made his way to the band. He goes, by, he came in the morning and listened to the Gurbani. He goes, Bhaji, I'm in the middle of the because he goes, I'm not the Sunini. Hanji. I'm not the Sunini. And even around the area, all of the parents say, You know what? In the world, Surili, we never heard Barney that way. And I went on the mic, I did put Jar on the mic. Hanji. And the one thing I said to say, You know what? It's looking lifestyle in the band, I'm not the Sunini. Hanji. So I'm not the Sunini. Why? I'm not the Sunini. 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 Marzo koi mila nonda nahi ya. Hanji. Gaane toh de Punjabi bohot uchhi lagya. Thik hai job ne kar kar thik hai pa. Gurban na joro. And the good thing was, when people heard this, Pendale Gurdwaro on lagya Amrita Ville. Hanji. The Darbar used to be packed. Shamanu Arera Sabli, the Darbar used to be packed. Hanji. Why? It's something pulls them in. And it's like India, but Marz is there. This the Tarti the Gurwan de Tarti ya. But People are sort of breaking. I'm not saying it's all bent, but no. the thing I saw there, it's like to see bent to Gurbani ki oni na pyar kar diya. And sanu oni bent da, I mean, that's a little one. That made impact. No one started saying, "Why you want to do kirtan?" I mean, sit down, kirtan karo ve. Simran karo ve thea. Kind of started doing that once a week. Oh wow, that's it's really good. It's all about encouragement. I'm not saying India ki oni ka kam hunda hai thea. Just sanu oni bent da, not me, but anybody. But why can't they continue that? Hana thea, Hanji. So. I've got a few more things to do in India, a few okay. more programs to do. Sukhna Sada Part, people invite me out to do Sukhna Sada Part as oh, well over nice. there. Hanji, very There's good. There's a, um, a trip planned to Canada. Okay. So I'll unveil it now. Where? It's going to be Vancouver? in about October time, Vancouver, Vancouver side of okay. things, for about two weeks. Okay. It's still in the pipeline. I'm not sure if it's probably confirmed yet, but okay. things have been sorted out. Okay. Um, so I'm hopefully going to go two weeks. It's going to be the Vans. When do you think that will be? What month? Just o start of October. But first again, two weeks. You'll announce it on it, social media. Yeah, it'll be okay. on social media. Tika, Hanji. Um, it'll be all announced on there. I'm trying to get things done in Canada. There's huge demand. Yeah, like, there so you've is. been there. People it, are trying to say to me, I'll get emails a lot of times. So, you come to Canada, do something is, over here. Definitely. It's not me. Like I say, it's not about me. I'm trying to say me, me. It's not about ego. No, but it's... Someone's inviting me over to do something. This is the thing. I want to go there and do Hanji. it. If it helps flourish the key, people yeah. are going to join Gurbani that kind of way. I'm going to do it. 
So people saying to me, come over there. So for two weeks in Canada, I'm going to go over there. That'd I'm trying good. to do come evening the vans. It's going to be uh, weekend the vans. We're going to do Qatar for an That's hour. That's really good. Not just the vans. We're doing Girtan, nothing no, like that. But Qatar Straightforward well. talking, doing English and Punjabi. And you. I'm going to read a Gurbani in a melodic way. I'm drawing a whole evening the vans where people can come in after work and say, you know what? Let's just relax and meet Maharaj. Exactly. We come back from work straight home. No, it's true. Khana, though, go, watch better TV, go about the Karke Somo. Break away from the cycle. So I'm hoping it's going to make a huge impact. I'm trying to visit many Gorda within the Vancouver side. It's just stage one at the moment. Mm -hmm. If I can hit the um, west coast of Canada, I'll do the east coast. Hanji. Moving to America. I've got Benji from America. Uh, contact me. She goes, Baja, come to America. We'll pay for your ticket. So there's some things happening there. This is Sharda of the Sangat. Yeah. They say, forget the Gurdwara, trying to organise people to come over. We'll pay for this ticket. Why? Because we want you to come over here and have this impact on our children, on us, because we can relate to you. It's a relatability again. Yeah, and can Six Channel probably get an exclusive to cover that? Because that would be it. fantastic. I want to hit it. radio stations over there as many channels as I can. So look, this is what's happening exactly. in the UK. That's the thing. Sikhs first in Canada. So amazingly. Is, yes, How exactly. amazing the parliament, yes. the counterpart going in parliament, Nishan's the yeah, yeah. and then all those kind of things like. So amazing how Canada's having an impact. It is. That's Let's the thing. move it forward. Let's move it forward. And the thing is, they did. They had a Sukhmani Sahib during Sikh Heritage Month yep. in Parliament. Exactly. And from what I saw there, I was, you know what, I, yeah, I, I mean, I can't even stress how, how much they are ahead of us and it's flourishing. Yep. So we'd love to have an exclusive for yeah. that. And then, Baji, my next question is this. You know, obviously, Gurbani Jodi Hegia, it's a universal message, yeah. right? doesn't matter if you're Sikh, Hindu, no. anybody. It doesn't matter what faith you are. And mm. No caste, no creed, nothing as Guru Gobind Singh Ji said. Yeah. How do the non-Sikhs react to your Parjad? Because I'm sure they must, they come to the Vans. Tell us a little bit about the non-Sikhs, because it's interesting. To be honest, the recordings that have been made I'm in, on YouTube, on my YouTube channel, and I never film myself, mm -hmm. okay? I, I've said before... I'm very uneasy around cameras, uh, which is strange coming to Sikh Channel Studio right now. I've got your uh, phone set up, by the way. I forgot to tell you. Recording. <laughs> Great, thanks for that. More pressure. <laughs> I, don't like, I don't really like the camera. So you notice, because like, even talk to you now, I, I, I forgot the cameras are there. Yeah. But now it's sort of impacted on me. The cameras are filming <laughs> me. It's just made me feel a bit uneasy. Okay. But um, when we're at these programmes and a lot of recordings, like I said, I don't film myself. Andy. People made snippets and they're on online. What it is, a lot of people who are especially the English side of things. Hanji. I'm not going to say the word, but it's, 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 it's sort of the, the English people. Yeah, Gore. Hanji. They are just hearing the melody of the Gurbani. Hanji. And they're getting curious why it's out there on social media. True. You know, Facebook's massive, Instagram's a huge thing yeah, out there. It is. Just snippets of Gurbani and people thinking, and you, the way you hashtag these kind of things. Hanji. And people going and thinking, oh, wow, I've had messages saying, oh, this is crazy, I've never heard it, oh, I don't wow. understand what's going on, but what is it? So start explaining to people what Sikh is about. That's this good. is what we're doing. Hanji. The message is universal. And there's a funny thing, it's not about me, it's about how other people, we're in Sikhi, we're, in, we're born in Guru Nanak Dev Ji's right? If you're Amrita and Amrita, we're yeah. in Sikhi. Exactly, okay? that's it. So for people who are westernised and not within this Dharam, they're being influenced. And a good example of this was, there was this family come from Europe once, mm -hmm. They had no clue about Sikhi and they saw a Nagra Kirtan. Okay. And Singh's wielding the sword, spinning around, they had it in the Gatka there. Hanji. This family, they, they come out online to tell the interview. Hanji. They had such an impact on the Gatka. They got so curious in the Gatka thing. He goes, he goes, Wow. It's such an impact on this one guy. Hanji. They learned about Sikhi. The whole Parvar took Amrit. Oh, that's amazing. Just from a Nagar Kid and Gatka. There you go, see? A European family. Hanji. It's like, hold on, Apa that, you Punjabi know, log here. Hanji. We've got this within our genes. I'm saying people haven't. No. But, but just a visual impact of Gatka. This Hanji. guy had goes, I didn't know what was going on in this street. Saw the Nagar I was just influenced by so much. He learned about it. The whole, in the clean, the kids, they took Amrit. See, that's amazing. That just shows, Hannah. It's this is the impact of this. I'm saying exactly. the rule, what we show on the streets, where it's Nagakit and the Pachawa doing Gordwari, a huge impact. Like I said, yeah. we're all Pacharaks. That's it, exactly. Amartari Hove and Amartari Hove, we're all Pacharaks. Why? We're all representing Guru Nanak Dev Ji Maharaj. And on that, Baji, we've only got less than a couple of minutes left. Yeah. Why is it important to live by the three principles of Nam Japana, Seva, Kirt Kamai? We've got one minute left. I just yeah. want to quickly. I'll quickly go through it. Yeah. Okay. The way it's supposed to be is Kirt Karo Nam Japo Dhavan Kishaku. Okay. Honest living. How many of us actually do honest living these days? 
ਵੀ ਟਾਉ ਜੇ ਕੰਮ ਨੇ ਮਾਰ ਜਾ ਕੇ ਕਰੋਨਾ ਆਪ ਉਹ ਉਹ ਕੰਮ ਕਰਦੇ ਆ ਆ ਮੈਂ ਕਿਮਨੀ ਫਰਮ ਇਸ ਲਾਕ ਡਰਗ ਡੀਲ ਗਵਨ ਆ ਦੇ ਸੇਇੰਗ ਆ ਬ੍ਰੇਕ ਮਾਈ ਬੈਕ ਆਲ ਡੇ ਸੇਰਿੰਗ ਡਰਗਸ ਵਾ ਉਹ ਕਰਤ ਕਮਾਈਆ ਹੀਸ ਵਰਕ ਨਿਸ ਹਾਰਡ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਬਟ ਇਸ ਦਾ ਕਿਰਤ ਕਮਾਈਆ ਗਲਤ ਕੰਮ ਕਰ ਰਿਹਾ ਰਾਈਟ ਕਿਰਤ ਕਰੋ ਨਾਮ ਜਪੋ ਵੈਨ ਡੂ ਆਨਸ ਲਿਵਿੰਗ ਆਪੇ ਤੁਸ ਰੱਬ ਦਾ ਨਾਮ ਲੈ ਮੈਂ ਮਾਲ ਸ਼ੁਕਰੀਆ ਜੋ ਪੈਸੇ ਮਿਲੇ ਵਿੱਚੋਂ ਖਾ ਸਕਦੇ ਆ ਆਪੇ ਤੁਸ ਰੱਬ ਦਾ ਸ਼ੁਕਰਾਨਾ ਕਰਾ ਵੰਡ ਕੇ ਸ਼ਕੋ ਵਾ ਉਸ ਕਮ ਨਾ ਵਿਸ ਕਿਰਤ ਕਮਾਈ ਕਿਸ ਦੀ ਕੋਈ ਹੈ ਨਹੀਂ ਸਨ ਆਨਸ ਲਿਵਿੰਗ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਨਾਮ ਜਪਨ ਸੇ ਰੱਬ ਨੂੰ ਸਾਰੇ ਭਲਾ ਬਠੇ ਵੰਡ ਕੇ ਸ਼ਕਤੀ ਸੇ ਆਪ ਖਾਈ ਜਾਂਦੇ ਆ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਵੰਡ ਕੇ ਕੋਈ ਸ਼ਕਤਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਅੱਜ ਕਾ ਵੀ ਵੀ ਲੋਸਟ ਦੀ ਯੈਸ ਮੋ ਗੁਰੂ ਨਾਨਕ ਦੇਵ ਜੀ ਸਾਈ ਕਿ ਬਕ ਆਨ ਦਾ 3 ਪ੍ਰਿੰਸੀਪਲਸ ਯਾ ਵੀ ਕੈਨ ਸਮੈਸ਼ਡ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਬਾਜੀ ਐਂਡ ਅਗੇਨ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਰਨ ਆਊਟ ਆਫ ਟਾਈਮ ਵਿਚ ਮੀਨਸ ਵੀ ਵਿਲ ਹੈਵ ਯੂ ਓਨ ਅਗੇਨ ਓ ਗੋਡ ਸੋ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਸੋ ਮਚ ਫॉर ਯੂਰ ਟਾਈਮ ਐਂਡ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਵਾਟ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਸਟੇ ਇਨ ਚਾਰਟੀ ਕਲਾ ਸਪਰੈਡ ਦ ਵਰਡ ਕੰਟੀਨਿਊ ਟੂ ਡੂ ਦ ਗ੍ਰੇਟ ਸੇਵਾ ਥੈਟ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਥੈਟ ਸੋ ਵੀ ਵਿਲ ਲੁੱਕ ਫੋਰ ਟਾਵਿੰਗ ਯੂ ਬੈਕ ਇਨ ਦ ਫਿਊਚਰ ਸੋ ਸੰਗਤ ਜੀ ਹੋਪ ਟੂ ਸੀ ਇੰਜੋਏ ਕਿਤਾ ਸੇਗਾ ਆਈ ਆਨ ਆਵਰ ਆਈ ਇੰਜੋਏਡ ਇਟ ਇਟਸ ਬੀਨ ਐਬਸੋਲਿਟਲੀ ਅਮੇਜ਼ਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਹੈਵ ਬੋਡੀ ਹੇਅਰ ਵਿਦ ਅਸ ਵੀ ਵਿਲ ਡੂ ਅ ਫੋਲੋ ਅਪ ਇਨ ਦ ਫਿਊਚਰ ਐਂਡ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਡੂ ਗਿਵ ਅਸ ਯੋਰ ਫੀਡਬੈਕ ਐਸ ਯੂ ਆਲਵੇਸ ਆਸਕ ਯੂ ਟੂ ਐਂਡ ਲੈਟ ਅਸ ਨੋ ਵਾਟ ਮੋਰ ਯੂ ਵੁਡ ਲਾਈਕ ਟੂ ਸੀ ਆਫ ਕੋਈ ਗਲਤੀਆਂ ਵੀ ਹੋਏ ਬੁੱਲਾ ਚੋਕਾ ਦੀ ਮਾਫੀ ਐਂਡ ਵੀ ਲੁੱਕ ਫੋਰ ਟੂ ਸੀਇੰਗ ਯੂ ਐਂਡ ਬ੍ਰਿੰਗਿੰਗ ਯੂ ਮੋਰ ਐਕਸਕਲੂਸਿਵ ਇੰਟਰਵਿਊਜ